Assalamualaikum and good morning to Madam Nur Azaria. Let me introduce myself. My name is Wana Shafika binti Wan Muhammad Rozi and I will present about the Wana Bros background and important facts. Well, who doesn't even know Wana Bros? The first thing that pop out in our mind is DC, Harry Potter, Wana Bros Studio London, which is quite famous for tourism place and many more. Warner Bros is a highly integrated broadcast entertainment corporation and a global leader including produce, manufactures, distributes, licenses and markets all types of entertainment and associated business. So Warner Bros was curated in 1923 by brothers Harry, Albert Sam and Jack Werner before diversifying into animation, televisions and video games. The corporation established itself as a pioneer within the American industry and is one among the big five major American film studio as well as a member of the movie association. So the headquarter of Warner Bros is located in Burbank, California. They also have occupied staff in more than 30 countries. Warner Bros has been viewed as one of the nation's top motion picture and television production and post-production amenities and also houses 35 sound stages. Warner Bros not just focusing on creating film industry only, but the company have operates an innovative variety of business segments where they call it divisions. So there are nine primary business segments of Warner Bros, which is motion pictures, home entertainment, television, DC, consumer products, global kits, young adult and classic, technology, live theater, and studio operation. Now, the new chair and CEO of Warner Media Studios and Network Group is Anne Sarnoff. She is responsible for all of Warner Bros. media content focus teams, which uniting the Warner Bros. Picture Group, HBO and HBO Max, the Warner Bros., DC, and many more to work together across titles, brands, and franchises. and I'm going to be explaining further on the marketing mix of Warner Bros. Studio. So there will be four types of marketing mix which is the product strategies, pricing strategy, place strategy as well as people strategy. So the first marketing mix that I'm going to be explaining is on the product strategies. So what is product strategies in Warner Bros? So since every one of you already know, Warner Bros is one of the prime international entertainment company distribution as well as move maker incorporated in United States of America. Uh, the involvement of Warner Bros in the product marketing mix will be their distributions on the theoretical motions film, TV shows, home videos, product, television programming as well as their latest Warner Bros studio tour in London. And what makes them unique from the other competitors is around the world is because due to their visionary and creative minds on innovating and extraordinary contents like their films, TV shows, and also their video games. They also have published books and magazines under the divisions of Time Warner. And moreover, Warner Bros. Studio has also made a merger and acquisitions with several film libraries including the famous Lego movie and the Hobbit trilogy and last but not least would be their major prominent product is their Warner Bros movie that is made in Hollywood has gained a lot of attention on popularity among the international audience so now I'm going to be focusing on the pricing strategy which is the second marketing mix so since Warner Bros they has offered a broad segment to its international audience this has led to a wide pricing strategy for their entertainment service so the first pricing strategy will be Warner Bros on planning thoroughly with its investment in films the distribution of various scenario analysis of the films and many more this is because due to its volatility and competitiveness in the industry and moreover the tv contents from its licensing tv show programs to network and television subscriptions has generated to their product revenues besides they also have set 
a competitive pricing in its productions of the Blu-ray and DVDs of Warner Bros which is include the behind the scenes of the movies and all the characters think and lastly will be Warner Bros they have made an in agreements with the producers of the film to distribute the film only on selected regions across the world therefore we can see that the involvement of film distributions on taken as per the film budget a location and region distributions is one of their pricing strategy of Warner Bros in marketing mix Hi, my name is Noor Asila Mithiawaka with my ID number 20193617939. On today's video, I'll be presenting about two of the four P's, which are the place and the people. Well, without further ado, let's get started. Well, talking about the place, Warner Bros has a global reach, owning to its popular movie, and it has excellent worldwide distributions. So where can the users purchase the product? The users can purchase the product through the two marketing channels. The firstly will be where it sells directly to the customers, and the second will be where the wholesaler sells to either retailers all over the country, and then later sells to its customers. And also, users can access online through Amazon Videos, iTunes, and Warner Bros. Shop. Warner Bros. has its product available to over 500 distributors nationwide. These ensure that the products are readily available to its customer in the various parts of the country. Also, at the Warner Bros. WB shops, whether it's online or you can purchase it to directly to them, sells the DVDs, Blu-rays, 4K format books or movies. It also sells accessories and merchandise where the customers can purchase its favorite accessories or the movie's character. You know that you can rent Warner Bros. movie? Yes, you can rent the Warner Bros. movie through the Amazon video for 24 hours only and you also can use the qualities whether it's standard definitions or HD high definitions. What I can conclude from the place, Warner Bros. offers and provide the customers whether you can purchase it through online or direct to them. Moving on to the people, Warner Bros. focuses on the people as an organization where this includes employees and its customers. Warner Bros. company and its employee mainly focuses on the diversity which leads to the multicultural growth, workforce growth and intensive growth. Warner Bros. does not discriminate between its customers and the delivery quality contents that it offers all across the globe. Warner Bros. delegated its customers' tasks into a department, whether it's marketing department, in sales department, or customer service departments. These individuals have been trained into a persuasive strategy and also to show respect for business customers, taking their needs into account. For example, customer service departments, where they are responsible to deal with the customer's problem and to ensure that the problem must be solved. Also, the person in charge with a product must obtain the raw materials in maintaining and enhancing the qualities of the final product produces. From the people strategies, what I can conclude that the employees must serve customers with its best and also the companies must ensure and provide its employees' needs. Therefore, they will gain the effectiveness and the efficiencies of the operations of Warner Bros. Thank you so much and that's all for me. Hello and Assalamualaikum. My name is Nur Shahza Amira binti Muhammad Badrul and today I'm going to talk about the challenges faced by Warner Bros Entertainment. So in this presentation, I'm going to talk about what is um, the challenges faced by Warner Bros Entertainment and what they need to do in order to sustain in the industry. As we know, all kind of businesses, despite how big or how small their influence on us, they have to deal with their own challenges that somehow will determine their sustainability. It can be seen, especially during this pandemic, many businesses had to shut off their operation due to the lack of sales and supplies to run their business. In the film industry, Warner Bros Entertainment is facing a dramatic change 
in the industry due to the COVID-19 has made them to stop producing content. The sole reason is simple because the theatres are closed and will not be open until the vaccine for the virus is yet to be found. This has made them to release the new movie on their cable TV like HBO Max on the same day as the theatre date. Therefore, they need to increase their online platforms due to the current situation that needed them to stay in touch with the viewers through online platform. Moreover, with the increased number of competitors like Netflix, Warner Bros Entertainment facing another threat for their position in the industry. This is because Netflix is producing contents like them too. Plus, Netflix only uses their digital platforms to release the new movies had given them the advantages of cost saving and also increased customer preference. Therefore, they face a threat in a digital world where they need to explore and find a solution to be in it. Another challenge they are facing is somewhat closest to the Internet of Things where they need to be alert on the software and other technologies for the purpose of connecting and exchanging data with other systems over the Internet. So without further ado, I'm going to pass uh, to the next presenter which is my friend Mama Adam. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Muhammad Adam Aiman bin Muhammad Noh. So right now I will tell about the future trend of the business. So the future trend of the entertainment business in the media industry which consists of companies like Warner Bros that own content and license intellectual to property as well as distribute media through uh, television and film doesn't uh, look good at first when the pandemic COVID-19 hit the entire world. As one of their main sources of revenue, which is cinemas, theme park, and other things that involve massive people gathering must be closed in a lot of countries. The impact of COVID-19 also on movie theaters has accelerated to lead to two situations, which is more people are staying at home to enjoy movies and others, uh, entertainment and more studios, media, and media distributors are developing their own uh, direct to consumer streaming service. Uh, so, uh, but Warner Bros has proven to remain competitive in this uh, entertainment business as the companies uh, continually adapt to the consumer's taste uh, in both content and distribution. The Warner Bros company has uh, observed and identified that there is a shift over the past uh, few years where uh, consumers are switching from cable programming to over-the-top uh, streaming service. Uh, the Warner Bros company also have uh, adjusted for this uh, change and expanding in their own streaming uh, services under the uh, Warner Media, which is HBO Max, that offer the company digital uh, digital content like movies and TV series. The Warner Bros. Studios have also gained a lot of subscribers throughout the industry as they launch uh, HBO Max. And the uh, companies have been seeking uh, an innovative ways and solution to expand their distribution uh, channels. Uh, the Warner Bros. company has also proven to be one of the tops in terms of the entertainment uh, business that grow popular content, expand internationally, and innovate for future online uh, trends. Their future di digital content, like their upcoming movies, will also be in the HBO Max, making their position as an entertainment business can be success for the long term. The strategies to do a joint venture with other company is also a good strategy conducted uh, by the Warner Bros, uh, which is Universal Studios and Warner Bros uh, announced that there, uh, that there is a new venture going on to pull their DVD distribution unit uh, admits falling sales. This is a very crucial uh, strategy made by Warner Bros in sustaining a good relationship with other companies as well as to maintain their presence in the entertainment business. That's all for me. Thank you.